Hey, what's up, everyone? This is going to be a user revenge game. Better let you use revenge. New construction options. It's going to be on Doom Patrol. Building. It's going New to be a one versus options. one, Allies versus Soviet. Construction and by the complete. way, or the Doom Patrol, Dune. If you guys don't know what a Dune is, a Dune is like the really, really sandy part of a desert where like there's like no moisture and it's just like. It's just like all like real sandy. Construction complete. Unit lost. Building. New construction options. Cause I actually was watching some some videos on YouTube and I seen like the de what what a dune is and a dune is like a part of the desert. It's not just like and I guess the the sand is supposed to be softer and it's supposed to be more sand there. It's actually kind of interesting. Construction complete. Building. New construction options. Yep, so there's a little bit of water in this desert, so... Anyway... I clicked 2 minus from War Factory. Usually I click 2 just in case I, I decide to go Unit 2. Ready. I don't have to click again. Because I want to get them out as fast as possible. But a lot of the time I have... Complete. If he goes 1 minus from War or he rushes... Building. Um... Cancelled. Well, if he rushes, I'm just going to go one minus from War and then start camping. I'm going to have three minus versus two and go on to the defensive. If he goes one minor from War, then attacks. I might hit the second, right the second one, depending on what he does. Unit ready. Ah, there it is. I, I, Insufficient funds. You can only go one minor from War to the Soviet. Even one minor from War is sometimes risky. New rally point but what you don't want to do is go straight tanks complete. and try to attack the, the Soviet. People with um less you money are gonna lose. Structure sold. You don't try to like rush the Soviet when you're allies. So you're you're sir, not gonna yes, win. And you could do try to do an air rush, but I mean not just like rush Unit it and tank rush like, right away. Construction it's not complete. Anyway, so new construction options. Building. I know there's a lot Building. of builds in your Revenge, Unit but if ready. you guys know the concept of what the meta is, sometimes you kind of had to play the meta in certain maps like. And this, you complete. gotta go one minor from war. Training. You gotta Unit ready. kind of do some of the same stuff. Building. Not, not really, Unit but I mean, ready. it actually helps to do some of the same stuff. Have a pattern because if you're just improvising too much, you're gonna start losing. Like do something different every game. You're not gonna remember what to do. Then, you know, building. Kind of have like a stable thing where you know this is what I usually do. I'm usually gonna go one minor from war. You know, maybe two minus war if, if he doesn't building. rush. New construction options. Unit ready. And like that for any RTS game, kind of. But I mean, maps construction make a big complete. difference, and also the game makes a big difference. Building. Unit ready. Now, I'm going for a fast ear or peer fire, but it's not really not that fast of an peer fire because considering the fact that. Reinforcements I ready. I think he only has one more figure. So right. right. Commander. The fact that he's making gonna make a lot of desolators, he's expecting me to go Mirage tanks, but I'm gonna actually not go just bypass making Mirage tanks and just keep making more Grizzly tanks. And the Grizzly tanks like the wind are going to be really good. Because they're not gonna get desolators. Desolators have to be difficult to kill them. I was watching that plane, I was like, did that plane hit the desolator or not? I wasn't really sure. Building. Couldn't really see. Building. Now here's a trip if, a trick if you want to be really cheap you know just fill up the battle force with the GIs and that's the one thing about about USA that's really good the fact that the GIs are good I mean the GIs are good they're free and like the other allies don't have them for free like if you're Germany if you're Great Britain if you're France if you're on hold any of Canceled. the allies, including Korea, complete. you don't get them. So, Reinforcements but ready. like obviously it's not Unit as good ready. versus Rhino tanks, but it's gonna be more of an anti-desolator thing. Thrusters engaged. They just don't simply don't have the Unit range. Ready. Or my under attack. I was like, Unit I got the right ready. one. Like I got the right one because usually if there's Unit multiple ready. flag trucks, you want to fire at the flag truck that has Train. desolators in it. Building. Sometimes you kill the dozen ladies inside. Sometimes Unit you ready. don't. I think if you if you hit Building. with like kind of overkill Select the flag truck, target. it kills the dozen ladies. But sir, yes, sir. I don't think I did right there. Now yes, here's a trick. I'm gonna go. Unit I'm gonna ready. go three. Garden GS two. On hold. 
Unit ready. So I have three Guardian GS, two GIs per Battle Fortress. Because it's, I don't need to need to buy a suit. It's cheaper. It's cheaper and better. Our base is under attack. Or miner under attack. So if you would have run it when it in hard on this freaking miners right there, I would have freaking smashed them. So right now I want to um Our base is under attack. get some pillboxes off. Unit lost. And if he attacks me, I'm going to run away with the Battle Fortress. Oh, looks like he's going to blow the bottom half of my Unit base. Lost. Oh, now here comes the... Freaking... Yeah, they are. Unit ready. Well, there's my um, Battle Unit Fortress. Attack. Killed them all. Unit lost. Unit promoted. Or minor so I didn't work out. So I actually complete. cleared the board. I lost all my Grizzlies. Every single one of them. But my Battle Fortress, my most important and strongest unit, lived. So he's gonna have to come me with another, another wave. Okay. Select target. Okay, so he's still going. You know, I, he still got uh, about three war papers, I think. On the go. He's still going. I got the ore purifier up, and notice how I'm not making mirage tanks. That's the key part of this. Key part of this game is some, it's like a learning lesson, like. You almost always, almost always build Mirage Tanks, but this is a special map, the fact that, you know, this is like a map where you just like walk up and just desolate the living crap out of them. I mean, there's no like bridges on this map, there's no water, there's, there's no way to barricade them. They're gonna get, the desolators are gonna get into your base. So the best thing to do, probably, is not to make any Mirage Tanks and go Grizzly Tanks and go Pillboxes and win with the Battle Fortresses. And notice... Three guardian GIs, two GIs again, same exact thing. And you could actually mix it up sometimes. So I mean, I've seen a lot of people go, um, four guardian GIs and one regular GI. But I, I think this is better the way I'm doing it because it's cheaper. You and notice how much money I got. Holy freaking crap, I got a lot of money. Unit lost. Uh, it's almost kind of Select ridiculous. How did I get all that money? I, I shouldn't Unit be spamming lost. like planes and rocketeers with all that money, but I I didn't think I was going to get that much. How much do I have? Unit lost. Of, yeah, a lot. So anyway, Training. I accidentally deployed the Battle Fortress, but just one of them. I, it doesn't. It lose all my infantry. Just like two, three, four, three. Now, boom, boom, boom. Now he's going to chase that gun. And now I got away. And notice the speed enhancement. And there's no chance in hell he's gonna kill that. No chance in hell. But actually, I didn't need that elite battle fortress because even if it wouldn't have gotten a promotion, I still would have won that. Even if it was just a regular battle fortress. It's a good game. Unit lost.